I want to show you how to attach a database in SQL Server. So there's basically three steps to doing this. Uh, the first step is you need to find your data files. So for example, I have my data files that I want to attach on my desktop. <clears throat> I have an MDF file, which is where the data is, and it should have a matching LDF file, which is the log file. So we need both of those files. Second thing is we really need them in the data folder for SQL Server. So I could attach them from out here, but they really need to be in that other folder. So I'm gonna go into File Explorer and go to that folder. The folder on my machine, and it'll depend on what version of SQL Server you're running, but it'll typically be under C, Program Files, Microsoft SQL Server. From there, it'll pin on the version of SQL you're running. On mine, it's under SQL Express, MS SQL, and there is that data folder. So notice there's some existing data files and LDF files in there. So we want to move those files from the desktop into this folder. Before I do that, I just want to show that full path Maybe you can pause the video here if you want. Here's that full path of where to find the data folder, but it will depend on the version of SQL that you're running. All right, so we have the files. We need to move them into the folder, so we can either drag them in there, or I'm just going to select my two files, cut them from the desktop, and paste them into that data folder. So we have them in the correct folder. Now we just need to do the attach, which is pretty straightforward. So we want to open up uh, SQL Server Management Studio. SQL Management Studio. I already have it open because it takes a minute to open on my machine and I don't want to wait while making this video. But once you have the Management Studio open, I'm going to show you how to do the attach. So over here in Object Explorer, you want to just right click on databases and there's the attach function. Then it's just a matter of browsing um, and finding your data files. So when this dialog opens, just hit the add button here. And notice it takes me to that data folder where that file is that I'm going to attach. So if you didn't have the files in the right folder, you might have to go browse here um, and find those files you know, over here uh, in your documents or on your desktop or something like that. But since I've got them in the right folder, it takes me to that folder and I can just choose the MDF file that I want to attach here. So I think mine was called Bookstore. So I'm going to click that file and just hit OK. Shouldn't have to change anything here. Just hit OK on this screen. And that's it. Uh, after you do the attach, you might want to check and see if that file is indeed there. So I can expand my databases node here. And if you expand it and you don't see it here, uh, over here in the Explorer, you can hit the Refresh button. And then you should see any new databases, including that one that I just attached. From there, I could even go in and check the tables and so forth that are included in that database.